Hey guys, another rambling movie minute. Quick review here uh, with me just back from the theater is wife of the show, Missy Sorg, just saw Insurgent. Of course, just came out this weekend, the sequel to uh, Divergent, is it? Yeah, the Divergent yeah. series. Yeah, the and there's a cat series. in the shot. Um, <laughs> uh, so what did you think of uh, Insurgent just coming back from the movie? Like, this this is funny. For, for those of you who are watching this, I literally walked in the door five minutes ago. <laughs> so so this is just fresh back from the movie. Right theater. back from the movie. So what'd you think? Um, What's your impressions? I thought it was a decent movie. I mean, it was it was okay. It was it wasn't the greatest. It wasn't the the worst. It was it was all right. It was nice, action packed. It had some very good storylines, and it had uh, a continuation of the story that started with uh, with the, with the first installment, and it just kind of picked up a little bit later from where they were. Um, by a little bit later, I mean probably momentary after the last movie ended. Um, so it, it literally picked up right where it left off and just continued the storyline through. Now, this is, a, of course, based on a book, the Divergent series. Did, uh, did, how did it feel? Does it feel like a kind of the kind of movie that comes from a book? Um, yeah, I mean, you, you can kind of see the plot stuff. You can see how, oh, okay, there it goes. My sister has actually read the, the series, which is one of the reasons she wanted to go see the movie for her birthday, mm-hmm. uh, which is why we went to see it this weekend. Um. She said that it follows the book series pretty well in comparison to other things. Like I know with the the Lord of the Rings, everybody was all sorts of upset that they left so much stuff out of out of the movies. But when there's that much information in those books, it's kind of difficult to get everything in. Mm-hmm. My sister's been very happy with how it portrays from book to screen. So good, good. So, um, I, where, where were some other thoughts coming out of this? You said you're kind of you're kind of like eh, okay about this movie, right? Yeah, I mean, I, I was okay with it. It was just another action movie um but with with a heroine instead of a hero and uh there's some story behind it it's not all just action-packed stuff um i I like the premise of how they do the things Mm -hmm. um for a reminder like how what is the what is the general premise uh, it's it's kind of matrixy okay um these these people have kind of they they're put into different categories of what they do for the community right um, you know, so there's, there's the law and order, there's the justice, there's the servants, there's the kind of politicians. And I believe it's like their 18th birthday or something like that. They, they go for this test to kind of figure out which grouping they should be in. Then they have the ch- option to choose which grouping they're going to be in, but they ultimately decide which group they're going to be in. If it's a different group from their family, like from their parents, they sever ties with their parents because the the groups don't intermingle. Um, The divergent portion of it is that she's different. Her test, she tests out of those categories. She tests across all of the categories. So that makes her different. She's not classified. And for purposes of the movie, that makes a very important character. Mm -hmm. So, you know, the, the premise is completely around her. And how awesome she's going to be to change everything. Now, is this um, is this the last in the series? Is there another one coming up? Is it, did they kind of leave it off, or um, they left it off at a point where they could actually stop it if they wanted to? But I believe there is another book in the series. Okay. Um, so, but well, so it wraps up pretty can... nicely if you're just dropping into this one. Yeah, and it picks up. There, there's some flashbacky type of stuff. So if you didn't watch the first one, you can kind of walk into this one blind and be like, "Oh, okay, cool." Mm-hmm. Uh, my sister obviously read the books. She watched the movie and she's like, Hey, this is really cool. I want to go see this. Um, you know, so I mean, there, there was background. I saw the, the first movie with her. So I had the background for, for it. And yeah, walking into it this time, I could have walked in without having seen the first one. Awesome. Awesome. So final, uh, final, final thoughts, uh, you know, on the show, we like to do go to the theater, um, uh, go to the theater or rent it when it comes out on Redbox, or just wait for it to pop up eventually on, on a Netflix or something like that. What, what, what kind of rating would you get on this further? Um, give me, um, um, give me, uh, if you've read the book versus if you haven't read the book, <laughs> if you've read the book, you're probably going to want to see it in the theater because there will be stuff that people are going to be talking about. Mm-hmm. And if you've read the book, it's like, oh, man, um, having not read the book, on the other hand, 
I could have easily watched it on Netflix or picked it up on, you know, Redbox or something. I, I would have been fine waiting for it to come out. Again, I just happened to go because my sister wanted to and it was like, yay, happy birthday stuff. Um, yeah, so that, that's my thought on it. Awesome. Thank you, Missy, for uh, letting us know, let us know what's going on with uh, Insurgent. I got the names mixed up. I'm not I'm not up on them too well. Um, but uh, you're, of course, at Rebellious Flaw if people want to f- follow you on the Twitter. Yes. Or at Wife of the Show if you want your wrestling uh, side of things. Yes. <laughs> and uh, I don't know. Anything else you want to plug? The, the only thing that I want to say is this is a spoiler. At the very end of it, it's an M. Night Shyamalan twist. It's a twist. Yes, twist. It's a twist. She's a guy the whole time. No, no, no that's no, that's not one of those. Not one of those. That's not one of those. So again, if you've read the book, you you know what I'm talking about. Uh, if you haven't read the book and you're just going to check it out, you're you're gonna kind of be like, uh, at the very end of it. Awesome. So uh, to check out this and other reviews, please subscribe to the YouTube van- uh, YouTube channel that this is on or the iTunes or, or whatever. You may find the Rambling Movie Minute. And, of course, go to timetoramble.com. We got a whole bunch of stuff over there at this video. There he is. Uh, a whole bunch of stuff and other shows. We have a weekly podcast with a, a lot of great people from Pittsburgh and New York and, and all kinds of uh, roundtables. They did one on Chappie recently. So please go check that out, and we'll see you guys next time. This show is a member of the Sorgatron Media Podcast Network. Find out more at sorgatronmedia.com.